following a car crash on Thursday. Chris Warren would not start, but did play wearing a black jacket. Second Seahawks possession, Warren would carry the load as usual, going for seven yards that led to a Casey field goal. And the ensuing kickoff, Ronald Humphrey fumbles, and the Seahawks' Terrence Warren recovers. Next play, Seahawks don't waste any time. Rick Meyer to Paul Green, the 18-yard strike. 10-0 Seahawks, and only took them 11 seconds. Meanwhile, the Colts, the magic man going from them again, Domikowski, gets absolutely nailed by Terry Wooden. And Jim Harbaugh would have replaced him for one play. And on that play, with Harbaugh in, Marshall Falk breaks it 45 yards for the touchdown. Falk, the rookie, the fourth Colt to go over 1,000 yards for the season. 10-7, Seahawks in the lead. Talk to Marshall Falk about his best asset, Robin. He says his vision, everybody here drive blocking on the Colts line. He does a great job of picking a hole, and then once he gets into the open, it's about a 4-3-40. Second quarter, it's still 10-7 Hawks. Rick Meyer intercepted by Ray Buchanan, who returns it 37 yards for the touchdown. Keeps going and going until he gets in the end zone. The fourth straight game with an INT tying a club record set by Charlie Stokes back in 71. What about it, TJ? Well, you have to give a lot of credit to Meyer for stepping out in front of Jason Belser. But he got his hand stepped on right there. Minor injury fracture to that left thumb. The magic man comes back and strikes to Sean Dawkins for the score. And the Colts go on for the 31-19 victory. The Colts scored 17 points on Seahawks.